Hello people, this is Bobby Buck with an infamous interview. And what we go do with this person right here, let this person introduce themselves. Who are you and what are you doing here? <laughs> What's happening, world? I'm the, I'm the infamous Cat Daddy, Cat Daddy 501, you know what I'm saying? Better known as Catfish the Misfit, you know what I'm saying? From Little Rock, Arkansas. Um, and I'm here handling business, having meetings. Um, Actually, I was here with my little brother, iHeart. You know what I'm saying? He got a lot of stuff going on. Uh, he just went platinum with Hit The Coin. And uh, now he's has Lena Davis number 10 on the Billboard charts right now. So I was out here. Um, you know, I work with the team, with the squad. PTE, SOD, Money Game. You know what I'm saying? Palm Tree Entertainment, Miami Mike. Okay, how long you been out this way in, in the, on the West Coast? Uh, I've been out here for two days. All right, all right. Um, I'm supposed to catch a flight today after a couple of meetings. Yeah, it's been interesting. We went everywhere, uh, and when I mean everywhere, everywhere, from R&B stations to pop stations, uh, I was introduced to a lot of people from Google to Yahoo. <laughs> it is a very productive trip. Shout out to Soldier Boy. You know yeah, what I'm saying? I yeah. Shot a video when I was down here. That's what I was, how how'd that go? You shot a video and you you kicked it at his spot too, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Soldier Boy got a big boy mansion. Salute, Soldier. You know what I'm saying? Man, nigga, young rich nigga, man, you can do what you want to. You know what I'm saying? When you got your own shit, you know what I'm saying? And um, he liked the music. I got a new single featuring I Heart, uh, Ric Flair. Woo! Feeling like Ric Flair. Woo! You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, speaking that been do, yeah, it's been doing pretty good right now. And, yeah. But unfortunately, <laughs> that's not the video that we shot. Uh, we shot uh, another video, uh, another song to my other song off my album called "I'm My Own Plug." So you know. Okay. Okay. So it was very spontaneous, but you know it happened. <laughs> so that's something coming out next. Yeah, definitely. I got a different mask. Uh, it'll be available on every site. Well, every site that's free for downloading with an in the Android or Apple phone right. or Spinrilla. You know what I mean? Right. Y'all go check it out. It's a classic. You ain't even gotta touch it. You know what I'm saying? If you gotta touch it, I don't even want your money. You hear me? <laughs> so how, how much longer you gonna be out here on the West Coast uh, when you're heading back south? Um, I'm trying to go back as, as soon as possible. I've been here. Um, I stayed over because I had to do a few things for myself, a few interviews, a yeah. few meetings. So uh, I got a later flight. But I plan on being back in Houston two day, later on tonight. Later on tonight, all right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so when the next time you're coming back out this way, you know, so we can probably set, uh, up, set up some things, you know. <laughs> uh, my, my little brother I Heart has um, uh, the Let's Dance tour with a screen. Yeah. He has the Let's Dance tour, and um, that's um, LA is on the list. Okay. You know, New York. We got New York, LA. You know what I'm saying? He real busy. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's, a, that's a hard young. That's a, that's a hard worker. He really working hard. Oh, cool, yeah. cool. Well, I got uh, one more thing I want to ask you about these other artists, these other independent artists. Since you are an independent artist. I am independent. I am not signed. Right on. So you're doing a lot of stuff on your own. So what little bit of advice you can give these other independent artists out here in Hollywood, L.A., everywhere else around across, across the globe? Well, shit, on the cool, I don't know what the fuck to tell them. Uh, I don't really know what the fuck to tell the independent artists in Hollywood. I mean, it's the population is uh, millions, and yeah. the businesses are here. So, if if that's the case, just stop being lazy. If 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 you're from somewhere else, I encourage you to leave where you're from. Right. So you won't have to deal with the social bias of people knowing you from um, being where you're from. You know what I'm saying? Right. People tend to, to, to show bias when they know um, where you're from. Right. You're just the same regular person, you know? Yeah. So. yeah. That's why I know when people know you from the past, they can't, they can't let that you know, they can't let that go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like I know some people in Arkansas, right? Yeah. I see people every day, but they look at me as being regular old cat daddy or regular old catfish. You right. know, when yeah. I come out, they can't really respect my craft because if they see me every day. Right. You know? So, um... When they see me with people like you and they see me doing things like this, hopefully 
you know, I can get a little bit more recognition for my music and my and my muscle, which is my brain, because it's hard out here. It's yeah, it it's is. hard to make it look easy, and it's it's very hard to keep faith and try. So right. that's what we on. We getting that, you know what I'm saying? 2016. Right on, y'all. I sure appreciate you giving me this infamous interview from you, and um, we go to holler at Cat Daddy on the next trip. She come back on out here, and um, from the West Coast to everybody else, this is Bobby Buck, and we out. Yeah.